Fortify archery. Bows do 20% more damage. Okay, that... That seems appropriate. Let's... Let's, let's see how that works. Should I enchant this item? That's a very important question. Why has it gone very quiet? Why is it... If I look up from this table and see an awful lot of students cowering behind objects, pretending to be terrified because their archmage is enchanting something, I shall be more than a little vexed. Okay, I have successfully enchanted your hat and your cape without anything going wrong, I might add. Eh? Uh-huh. Yeah, I, I can tell you're impressed. Sure. I'm choosing to believe you're impressed. Right. Here we go. Um, the Sea Dog Feathered Tricon now lets you do more damage with the bow. Not that you needed it, but to be honest, it was the best option. And I gave your cape 15% magic resistance, which is going to be useful, yeah? It's it's going to be good against fire, shock, all of them, yeah? A bit sort of more generic than having, say, fire resistance. I know right now... If you gonna... need anything else, just ask. No, 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 I'm I'm good. I, I, I feel like I'm going to need to do a lot more practicing before I'm comfortable with this, but it's a good start. Maybe as we find random unenchanted objects I can I can practice on them and then sell what remains I'm not happy with the disrespect the art mage is getting here I've got a few other things I want to do whilst we're here I want to uh, check out all of the different heads of the various schools to see what they are currently selling but right now what I want to do is find Tolf dear that's Enthir. Might want to sell him something. Before I before I run out of here, let's just double check Tolfdir is not right down here. He wasn't teaching them, was he? No. Okay. I Excuse still me. Need some help. If you can spare the time. Uh, afraid not. Very important Archmage business to attend to. I'm looking for Tolfdir, who it who is hoarding the sweet rolls, apparently. Uh, excuse me, Almond. I'm afraid I need to speak... Good to see to Skyrim still has such fine... Dolf, dear. You give an old man hope. Excellent. That's that's great. Greetings, Archmage. Right. Really did enjoy the Paralyze spell. Think I got the hang of it. Uh, was wondering, yes, is there anything more I can learn about alteration magic? Not at this very moment? No. Oh. However... Well, I've been working on something. An improvement oh. on the Ebony Flesh spell. Excuse me. I've made progress, but then hit a snag. I think perhaps you could help. An improvement on Ebony Flesh? Okay. What what's the problem? I need dragon scales, and not oh. just any dragon scales. Oh. As I've said, I made some progress using the essence of dragon scales, but they're just not quite potent enough. Essence My of dragon of Skyrim's scales. history is far from complete, but I did some research and discovered two things. First, there are ancient references to dragon heart scales. What little I could learn suggests they may be what I need. Heart scales? Second, there are stories of a dagger called Calvazine's Fang, said to be sharp enough to carve individual scales off a dragon. First, you'll need to retrieve the dagger, then use it to carve a few scales off a dragon. What? Presumably a deceased one. But presumably a deceased one. It's not like a live one's going to let me carve them. Actually, mm, that might actually be possible. Uh, look, could you, can I just get this straight? To master illusion, I just needed to look for a few books around the college. To master alteration, I have to find some ancient dag... Is that a relic? I have to find some ancient dagger and then find a dragon and carve off its heartstones. 
Oh, yeah, of course, of course, of course. Uh, yeah, sure, I will return shortly with the dragon scales. Yeah, of course I will. That would be wonderful. I'll be sure and have everything ready. This is exciting, isn't it? Yes, just do me a favor and don't hold your breath. It, it, how do I collect the dragon scales for you? Uh, is there anything else you can tell me about the dag- The dagger, yes! Actually, is this some sort of ancient relic that might, you know, be good to be displayed in a music- What is- Excuse me! Archmage! Conversation! Can you tell me about the dagger? Not much, I'm afraid. It was named Cavazine's Fang after Don't the dragon worshipped by this particular sect of the cult. They were said to be quite fond of ritual sacrifices. So fond, in fact, that the high priest spent a great deal of time sharpening the dagger. Stop eyeballing That way, your it was archmage. always ready for the next inevitable victim. Perhaps not the brightest spot in Skyrim's history, eh? Okay, so it was a dagger that belonged to the dragon. Oh, probably a dragon priest. Right. Anything more specific than that? Or have I just got to head into every single dr dragon, ancient Nordic ruin and see what I can find? Mind you, that's pretty much what I do all the time anyway. How do I collect the dragon Still scales the for you? Family? Not just any no, dragon scales. Not yes. Scales. Very special. Got it. You need so nice. fan, I came all the way to got that. Then, to if you should happen upon the corpse of a dragon, you should be my able to use it to slice off a heart scale or two. Even just one oh, should be enough well, for me to complete my research. Awkward. When you say the corpse of a dragon, do you mean like I could just find one that's been dead a while? It doesn't have to be fresh? Because sometimes I do stumble into them. Okay, you know what? Yes, fine, fine. If we, if we... I bid you safe travels. I still need some help. If you can spare the time. Well, no, 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 no. Uh, I'm still very, very busy doing... things. Over... Hi, just, just talk to me. Okay, I think I've got that. I think I'm also peckish. You want something from me? No, thank you. In you go. Time to go, eh? Yes! Okay. We need to go and test Soul Trap. Greetings, Archmage. Uh, greetings. Uh, yeah, we need to go and test Soul Trap out in the testing room. It probably has a much better name, doesn't it? What? Are you guys just testing spells or... Are we... Are we being invaded? No, what? Okay. Alright, what are we doing down here? You students better not be up to any... trouble. What? You're... You've summoned... You've summoned a frost astronaut in the wall. You better not break the college. Why is this flame astronaut not disappearing? And it has fire so... Okay. You didn't summon that. Did you find that out in the wilderness and bring it here? Uh, okay. Uh, well done, I guess. You know what? Not really my problem. Right, um, I need to test Soul Trap. Right. Which... All right. There goes. And, oh. Okay. Failed a little bit. And... Right. I soul trapped a stone. Um, okay, well... I'm probably gonna have to test that on something a little more alive. But I think I've got the idea. 
I still feel like I am a long way off being able to conjure the greater shelter. A long, long way off, unfortunately. What is on your mind? I snagged a few sweet rolls last night, so we should be good for a while. Uh, I just want to check you've Fooling our resources. got enough for your breakfast. Let's have a look. You got venison stew and four sweet rolls. Did you want anything else? You know, do you, do you want to try something different? Chicken dumpling for breakfast, maybe? I don't know. It's up to you, really. You, you just seem to eat sweet rolls and bread, mostly. What have we got on the table here? Is that... Black briar mead? I think it is. Right, let's sort my own breakfast out, actually. I'm going to have apple pie for breakfast. Yes. Probably not the healthiest breakfast ever. Almost certainly want to put a hood on. What is black briar mead? Okay, so... Time to go, eh? Yes, okay. it is. We're more or less done here. I've got a little practice to do. The plan for today is to go and take the spear to the guys, to Orion and the other explorers. Uh, oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Oh, having, having a moment, having, de definitely having a map reading moment. Not sure what is going on. Yeah, absolutely. Right. Tell you what, let's just get in the ship. Let's just get in the ship and see if I have a better time reading the map. For some reason, looking at the map is making my eyes swim. And I went the wrong way. I'm going the long way. Orion and the Explorers are at the Temple of Trinomac, which is close to Markarth. But we can't moor the ship in Markarth, so we'll have to take the carriage or find somewhere close by that we can moor the ship. For example, Rorikstead. I have a feeling the temple is actually about halfway between Rorikstead and Markarth, so that could be an option. Are you... Okay, don't mess with the gangplank. Do you want me to just call you inside so you don't have to go over the gangplank? You really don't seem to to like doing that. Not that I can blame you. Just make that a little easier for you. And... Finally! Where have you been, my friend? It wasn't that long. I know, it's getting chilly out there. Right, yeah. So we, we could moor the ship at Rorikstead and then travel through. What would that journey be like, do you think? Um, right, there's Rorikstead. There's the temple. Mm, we'd probably have to go... Well, either through the mountain or up and around and then... Honestly, I think it's just going to be easier to take the carriage to Markarth and go straight to the temple that way. Oh, right. Yeah, in Valthune, there is a hidden chamber we read about in one of Sanamir's journals. We should probably check that out while we're there. So, we will take... We'll take the airship to somewhere that has a carriage. Actually, I have a feeling that's back to Windhelm. I think this airship is going to be used mostly to get around Winterhold, Windhelm, and Riften. It seems to be on, like, on the east side, and then back to Solitude. So then we take the carriage to Markarth, and... Oh, right, yes, we've got a staff to find for Neloth. Which didn't strike me as all that important before, but seeing as the Enchanter at the college is a little on the useless side, it might actually be worth getting that staff. I have a feeling we're going to have to go back to Neloth if we want to get 
uh, further with our enchanting. So, yeah, all right, that's what we're going to do. We're going to travel to Windhelm and then take a carriage to Markarth. It is going to be chill. I'd like to travel inside, but I'm still reluctant to do that because, of course, we get locked in here, and if we hear a dragon attacking the airship, I can't get out to shout at it. Do you mind coming and keeping me company? Because, honestly, I don't relish the idea of just standing up there by myself. Might be nice to have some sort of shelter built over here. I was going to say maybe a little fire to keep us warm, but that might be a problem. The rest of today is out there beyond the mist. Let us go get it. Yeah! Oh. You know what? We, we, we could... We could just... I mean, we don't have to worry about dragons attacking now, so... Look! Why don't we just clear away the mist and the storm so it's more pleasant up here? Huh? Yes! That's what we shall do. I'm still thinking it would be nice to have some sort of shelter up here. Perhaps a magical one, like the summon shelter. I would summon the shelter here and see if it worked, but I have a horrible feeling it would stay right in place as the ship started to move and we'd get squished or something. I'm not willing to, uh, to experiment. Uh, oh, I'm thirsty. Okay, let's have a little water before we go. And on to Windhelm. And I'm already peckish. Okay, well, we made it to Windhelm, and it's still reasonable weather. All right. Windhelm actually looks quite nice from this angle, doesn't it? We're, we're a little higher up. We can see the buildings. Actually, Windhelm doesn't look bad. The city itself is quite impressive. There's just something very depressing about Windhelm. Probably the people. It's just... Uh, uh, come on. I, I will go and organize the trip. You try to get over your fear of that gangplank. Not that I blame you, but I think... You'll land in water if you fell off anyway. Right? Okay, that's probably not a hugely persuasive argument. Am I hungry already? I ate just before we got on the carriage. Apparently, traveling gives me the munchies. Okay, well, we've got a few hours of daylight left, so hopefully we can... You know what? I think it's a bit warm for the cloak. Yeah, hopefully we can make it to the excavation site, deliver the spear, to the explorers, and then be back in time to get a good night's sleep in Markarth. Although, there's also the secret chamber in the ruin nearby, Valthum. I would like to find that too whilst we're out there. It's just things like that have this horrible... Speaking of horrible... Yeah, things like that have this horrible tendency to end up taking a lot more time than you planned. And I do have another reason for wanting to get back to Markarth before night falls. I have a job there for the guild, and it's been a while. I sort of feel like we need to, um, you know, re-imprint our presence on Skyrim by basically stealing everything that's not nailed down. Although in this case, I think it's a, it is a numbers job, so that's going to involve stopping for more Nurn route. Has to be done. We're hey there, check out what my friend and I found. I'll sell some of it to you if you want. Okay. We've met, haven't we? 
guess. What are, what are you showing me and where did you find it? I found them near the old Dwemer Bridge in the far west. I'll mark it down for you on your map for a small fee. Okay, I like the hustle, but fine, your little swindler here's a septim. Show you before I take you over my knee. No, don't. Okay. Yeah, don't antagonize the creepy little children. Yeah, here's a septim. Thank you. You'll find the runes right here. Yeah, I believe... Haven't we already had this conversation? Or did I dream it in a horrific mm -hmm. nightmare? Those two are more terrifying than dragons. I can't quite put my finger on it. I mean, they're children, which makes them mildly horrible and slightly unnerving. Let's just run past the bear! But those two definitely take weird to a whole new level. We should check the map to see but hello again! We brought friends again. A bear. You must have quite a collection of bear rugs by now. So, you know, you're welcome. Could go in and see what they've got for sale as well. Was it here? No, it wasn't here, was it? Are we still being chased by a bear? My armor seems to think so. Or is it another one? Are we... What? Are we being... Are we being attacked? No, that's a hunter. That's a hunter. Yes, it's, it's, it's just... Let's not antagonize the orc tribe nearby. They're just out hunting. We just happen to be nearby as they were shooting arrows. Ooh. Can you remember how far it was inside that we left the explorers? No, it's over there. If it's the goat you're looking for, yeah, there it is. Unless that's your own pet hunting goat. I have no idea. They're orcs. That Okay, right. Uh, yeah, what I was thinking was maybe I will um, just take a few potions, get a little resistances going, just in case when we deliver the spear and they open whatever they're going to open, something horrible pops out, because that's pretty much normally what happens. Okay, few resists and regenerates. Better safe than sorry, I always say. Do I always say that? Well, I always think it, that's for sure. Yeah? Be prepared. And speaking of being prepared, can you remember how far it was in... It, was it pretty close? I can't remember. I really cannot remember where we left them. Okay, apparently we did not do a very good job excavating. Remind me to do some excavating on the way out. Hello! We have returned! And we... Wait! You let the Falmer move back in? What have you been doing while I've been away? Okay, yeah, we'll talk about it later. For now, please. We got, we got another one. We have another one over there. I shall illuminate him for you. There. Not there. Almost there. Got him. Right, shoot him. For Christ's that was a little uncalled for, wasn't it? I mean, really? Re really? Is that Latoria? 
That is Latoria. Latoria, if you could possibly not die, I have rather a lot of ruined books for you. What? Ah. Oh. Uh, thank you. Where, where, where is he going? Where? I'm chasing a Falmer through dark tunnels. What? Is this the way we came in? Or is this a quick... Where? On Earth. Okay. All right. Got this one. I'm going to leave the rest to you guys. And I have to say, I really do feel like you've been slacking whilst I was away. I mean, they've not even bothered excavating everything either. I mean... It's almost like I have to do everything myself. It really is. I'll tell you what. You can have a light, yeah? You have the light. Let's just go forward and make sure they've cleared the rest of them out. I mean, we go away for weeks, months. We collect hundreds of relics and items. We get the Snow Prince's Spear so that we can go through there. They haven't even made a... You could have moved the camp down here. Where's Orion? Am I hearing... Really? There's still more of them. There are actually more of them. From the sounds of things? Yeah. Where? Where? Wow. Okay, let's just... Let's go and... Clear everything. Or... Allow them to clear themselves. Yeah, you, you can help. That's fine. Oh! Nicely done. Okay. That was not clever. Also, why... Do you have boots with the same enchantment as I do? Because if so, you could have shared. Would have been appreciated. Okay. Is that Kira? Kira? Okay. Are you... Okay? You see him? Well, hurt. Either that or you... are looking for something. Do, do you need a light? Does that help? Okay then, I will leave you... To it. Have we... He really does not look good. But he doesn't seem to be hurt. <laughs> okay, well, um, carry on with whatever it is you're doing. I can't hear any sounds of combat now, so I'm assuming... Actually, let's not assume anything. I mean, let's be honest. There could be an army of Falma right around the corner, and apparently these guys would not have noticed. In fact, you know what? Let's just assume that is in fact the case. That does not... Okay, they do not look like foul now. Oh, it's... Um... What's the name? Uh, just... just... E Ariana! Hi! Hello! What are you... Why is this locked? 
pie. No, I'm not. No, no, I don't want to sell anything right now. You wait. Did we? Did we? Did we not loot these? Did we really not loot the eye? Have we had new bandits moving in? Did you guys just leave here and go off and have a long vacation whilst we were away working hard? And then when you heard we'd return to Skyrim, run back and try and pretend you'd been here the entire time. Because it really feels like you've allowed all the bandits and all the Falmer to move right back in and have done absolutely nothing. And I do mean... Nothing. I mean, I'm... I'm almost relieved that the chest is empty. I really am. Okay. I mean, really? There are things to excavate. This is definitely not the triumphant return that I had imagined. Okay, I'm trying to rem Oh! Hello! Latoria! Have you discovered anything in- Oh, in the box! I left you- Yes, in a fact, lot of Latoria was able to box. decipher some tomes, which yielded some interesting spell scrolls. Here are a few she made for you. Oh, are any of them conjure greater shelter? Because I would conjure familiar lightning. No. Okay. Uh, right, well, I've got some more ruined books for you, but I've also got something for you, Orion. Hello? You don't want to talk. I, I'm, I would, I'd like to talk to you. I, you're waiting for me to go upstairs and put the spear in, aren't you? Okay, Latoria, I do have some books for you. Excuse me a second. Uh... Okay. Right. Oh, tell you what. Do me a favor. Have a light. I, I've stored them in, in this. Uh, it's just a little thing I picked up. And Oh, I tell you what. I should also take the spear as well. Um, ruined books... That's ruined scrolls. Why have I got ruined scrolls? Let's not think about it. Right. I have more ruined books for you. Ah, excellent. Let's see what you have found. Ah, good, good. It will take some time to decipher these. Yeah, Come yeah. back tomorrow, and Latoria will let you know what she has found out. Right, right, tomorrow, yes. Okay, right. I have the spear. I'm going to go and place it. Oh, I'll tell you what, it really is a little dark. In the, um, was it a slot? It was a slot in the floor, wasn't it? Yes, it was. Right. Hello, Madras. You don't want to talk either. Okay. I'm activating... Do you not want to be here for this? No. Couldn't care less. Fine. Sticking the spear in the slot. Excellent work. Oh. That seems to have done it. Let's press onward, but do be careful. It's likely to get more dangerous ahead. Right. Okay, do it. Can I can I take do we do do we take this with us or will that close it? Oh no, get out of my way. Ah, okay, no, 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 we we've got to leave it in so that we don't get locked in. Okay, could you, could you please? You're in my way. Okay. Fine. I'm entering the temple. What am I hearing? Oh, Falma, 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 Falma. I've got a light above my head. Oh, you all followed. Okay, well done. I'm sure you'll do just fine. You know what? 
Oh god, I am failing. I will just do a little bit of paralysis. Aid you in your fight. There we go. They should be easy to kill now. There you go. Ooh, what is that? Oh, we got another. We got another warmonger here. What is this? Okay, this one is going to take a while to die. Let's get some poison on him. Oh, am I? Be wait, 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 wait. Oh, you're sh yeah, no. Sorry. Yes, I, I, I understand now. You're shooting the one behind me. No. Well done. Well done. Get up, man. Okay. You go and have a look at that, whatever it is. Tell me if it's important. I'm just going to, you know, ancient Falma Mace. I'm pretty sure we've got one of those, but it looks quite expensive, so we'll take another one. Is nobody going to exclaim something? Oh, look, some fancy thingamajig. No? Fine, I shall do it. Oh, look, some fancy... What did I hear? Stop pushing me. I definitely heard something. You know what to do with me. Really? Are we all just going to ignore the Falmer thingamajig? Well, it's not really Falmer, I guess. Snow Elf thingamajig. Okay, then. Let's ignore it. Fine, fine. Just going to see what's in here. Trinimax Might. Looks just like the other mace we found, but I'm guessing it's... A... Okay, are you mocking me? I feel like you're... Where's Orion? Oh, there you are. I feel like I might be being mocked here, ladies and gentlemen. We have an excavation site. Would somebody like to excavate it? Hmm? No? Gonna wait for me to do it? Of course you are. Well, I'm not going to. All right, let's... I'm not sensing any... Okay. Uh... My brethren, the time is nigh to emerge from the shadows, to cast off the chains of our enemies. Ariel and his ilk have forsaken us. See Now is what? the time to grab. Trinimac, for he too was deceived and cast down into darkness to be reborn a twisted form as we have. And through him, through Malak, we will have our revenge. Could you guys stop pushing me and get out of the way? The instigators of our demise. I can't move for some beyond our reason. reach. Those who drove us to their doorstep are still dwelling above. Malak has blessed me with the voice which now falls upon your ears. And sight to see the way to our victory. Gifts lost long ago. He has also blessed us with a great boon. I can't the tools with which we shall exact our revenge on the overworld dwellers above. Okay. A vision of temple in the ice, venerating his brethren, which holds the Ned Crescent blade of treachery. Ooh. With this weapon, we shall wreak havoc, and the world of men shall burn. <laughs> that was loud! 
we once again have interlopers present here. Do not allow them to That's leave this your fault. place alive. They saw you. Now is the time, right? I'm just gonna sow a bit of confusion amongst their ranks. If you could do the same, that would be great. Main guy over there, let them kill each other. Just stare at my way if you can't help. Ooh, this is going. Ooh, okay, do we. Whoa! Wee! Right, right, right. There you go. I'm going to. Avoid this ice, if you don't mind. Oh. Inigo, where are you? Okay. Well, those... Okay. Those guys seem to be focusing on each other, which is good. Great. Oh, no, no, no. Now they're focusing on us. Now they're focusing on us. Let's get a bit more confusion. All the confusion. What? Ow, ow, ow. Really? Is this one not dead yet? Come on! Okay. I'm gonna focus on keeping you alive. Right. Kira. Having a moment again. Right. Whoop. I'm being pushed up. You know what? If you guys are just gonna insist on getting in my way and pushing me around. Okay, that... Oh! I'm going to try and... He's immune to parallel... Oh, oh, okay, you know what? Right! We're being fireballed! Just... Oh, you know what? I'm getting away from these guys because they are definitely more trouble than the... Focus on him. Where? Where? Oh, okay. Where's Where's the big guy? Where's the? Okay, where's he gone? Where's he gone? I can't you just up and vanish into thin air like that. Okay, so it wasn't just me. some form of Malakath or Trinity. And they aim to use whatever powers they have been given in order to attack the surface. Yes, and with the kind of power we have seen from him, Torin could cause a great deal of havoc up there, especially with the war weakening everyone. That's a good point. Maybe we should warn the Yarls. Unfortunately, I fear there is no time for that. Even if we all split up and went to get the cold, I fear their forces have been stretched too thin, as you suggest. Okay. Plus, there is the added concern that the Neb Crescent is apparently involved. The what? Neb Crescent? Isn't that some artifact made by Shea Gorath? Ah, you've been reading more, I see. Yes, and not just the artifact either. The Neb Crescent is known to be the Blade of Treachery. Right. It was created by Shea Gorath and given to Malakath as a trick. The blade forces the wielder into a bloodthirsty rampage, attacking friend and foe. Malakath beheaded oh. his own son with the sword. Afterwards, however, Shale Gorath reclaimed the blade. So it's rather curious that Malok would be sending Tulrin to claim the blade. It's almost as if the twice spurned Falmer are being played by some other force, or Malok has some other plan for the blade. It does make me curious as to how the blade fell into the hands of the Snow Elves. So what's the harm in him finding the blade? Wouldn't he be just as likely to attack his own people? And it's only one blade after all. Excuse yes, me? The repercussions of using the blade in battle are not what concerns me. Though it makes the wielder fearsome in its own right, it also has the ability to sway people into acts of conquest and domination. Were Turun to bestow the blade upon a Jarl, for instance? Then that Jarl might wage war with the others. Independent on which Jarl it's given to could result in a pretty significant problem. Well, how do we stop him in time? 
Well, luckily from his speech, it sounds like they don't have the blade yet, and possibly do not know specifically where it is. So that gives us time to research it, and uncover the location of the blade, find the sword, and either safeguard or destroy it if possible. Though the latter is highly unlikely. I seem to remember you mentioning something about the Forgotten Veil, vale, a snow elven ruin looming over the glacial crevice. Perhaps that might be a good place to start. Oh, the veil! Yeah, uh, you wanna go? You wanna? You wanna go to the? Yeah, we we. Yeah, we can do that. I guess. Let's just check what these guys have got first. Okay, so there is a chest here with some stuff in it, but nothing really important. Where did they go? They're not fo- You guys are not following us. You guys are not following- You guys are gonna make your way to the Vale and we'll meet you there, right? Or the entrance. You're not following us to the Vale. No! No, you are not following me until I go to the Vale. I've got other things I need to do that don't involve you. Personal, private, thick. No! 